There's a moment, quiet but jarring, when you forget the name of someone you've known for years, and for a heartbeat, you wonder if your mind is slipping away faster than you expected. You laugh it off, but deep down, it scares you. Most people don't know that memory loss doesn't just happen. It's fed, shaped, and often accelerated by what you put on your fork. You may not realize that something as simple as blueberries, with their deep purple skin and quiet sweetness, carry anthocyanins that actually cross the blood-brain barrier and protect the neurons that help you hold on to names, faces, and stories. Or that a handful of walnuts, those wrinkled little brain-shaped miracles, deliver alpha-linolenic acid, which supports the very structure of your brain cells. And eggs, often pushed aside after a certain age, hold choline, a nutrient that most adults over 60 are drastically low in. Yet it's essential for the formation of acetylcholine, the neurotransmitter that helps you focus, recall, connect dots. This might explain why your thoughts feel foggy mid-conversation, or why you walk into a room and forget why. I used to think memory faded like an old photograph, inevitable, irreversible, but now I know better. It's alive, it responds, it sharpens or softens based on what you feed it, how you move, how you rest. So ask yourself, are you nourishing your mind like you still believe in its brilliance? Because it's not too late. It never was. What you remember tomorrow might just depend on what you choose today.